Hey guys, what's up? Nick here once again. This is going to be a quick unboxing and then a full review of the Best Tech wall adapter. Uh, now this is essentially just a charging station, but the cool thing about this is alongside the six outlets uh, that it has on there, it also has a charging station built on top of it for any of the new iPhones. So the iPhone 5 to the iPhone or the iPhone 6 Plus, all in, in between those with the lighting port. Uh, so that's pretty awesome. So let's get right into the unboxing here. If you haven't heard of this this company, Best Tech, they're really awesome. I'll have a link in the description below. Go check them out. I'll let them know that Panda sent you. And leave a comment also and a like to show your support as well, well and as always. So you get a little bit of an instruction manual here, just letting you know what's inside of it. So the Best Tech wall charging station, surge protector, boasts one single standard US wall outlet to six AC outlets charging up to six electronic devices uh, all at once. It also features four USB ports. And in addition, it includes three replaceable iPhone 4S micro iPhone 5S adapters for the charging dock, charging more devices than an average phone dock. Uh, we got AC output 110 volts by 120 VAC, 60 Hertz, 1,870 Watts. USB output is DC 5V, 5.2A totally. USB protections, USB circuits are equipped with overload, blah, 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 surge protections, both for AC outlets and USB ports. So also will protect your devices during electrical storm or power outages, which is pretty awesome. So let's get to the device itself. A nice bubble wrap here. Nothing else in the box. This is a quite large device or a large uh, protector, I should say. So let's slide it out here. Put that to the side for a second because there's a little bit more in here. I believe these are the three different adapters, depending on which iPhone or iPod you want to charge with the dock. So we got the normal, oh, it's actually a micro USB, so you can charge any Android device. So that's pretty awesome, I'll, uh, as you can see, micro USB. Then we got a lightning port for iPhone 5S, iPhone 5, iPhone 6, and 6 Plus, as well as iPod 5th generation. And then the 30 pin connector for the older iPhones as well and older iPods. So that's pretty awesome. They give you those three in the package, uh, which will pertain to the dock. So, and this only takes up one outlet, which is pretty nice. So you only have to worry about one outlet. It has a screw in the back as well. If you want to screw it into the wall to make sure it's not going to go anywhere. So that's pretty awesome. Also comes with a built-in light Ding. switch. We got AC, USB, both will light up whichever one you're using. On the right side here, we got three normal US proprietary outlets. There we go. On the left side, same thing, three proprietary outlets. On the top, we got the four USBs and the charging station. Okay, so the one thing I noticed that's a little bit odd is they have these three prongs on the bottom of each adapter. We put it into the adapting port, and actually they do not click into place and they will not uh, make any type of clicking sound to acknowledge that they are connected, but rest assured they do sit in there just fine. They're not gonna fall out. Um, they are on a spring board system, so if you put your phone on there, it will press down and start charging because the connectors will now touch. However, I believe this is the reason it doesn't click into place and doesn't stay um, on those prongs at all times is to both save energy costs and also for if you're not charging your device, um, it doesn't have to be on there, obviously. So that's kind of a nice, nice feature that it doesn't automatically always touch the prongs at the bottom so you're not always wasting power even if you're not charging a device. This port up here, however, the adapter organizer is literally just so you can hold an adapter there for future references if you need it there so you don't have to keep them in a carrying pouch or something or have them just nearby. Can, However, this does not have the three prongs um, on the bottom here on the adapter organizer, so you cannot charge two phones at once uh, per se. But it is nice that they added that so you don't have to worry about keeping you know, the other two adapters uh, in a separate area. Now granted, there is no third slot to keep the other one, so the third adapter, which you will not be using at all or might not use as much, you will have to keep nearby or in a safe location for one needed. All right, and we are back, and as you can see, I have it plugged in. And I want to apologize for my previous remark during the unboxing. This light switch, however, is actually an LED underneath that turns into a nightlight if uh, you so need it, which is actually a really cool feature. I uh, wasn't expecting that, so props to Best Tech for adding that. Very cool, so easy added light switch for a nightlight when needed. Also, as you can see, when I turn that off, we have the two glowing LEDs, one for USB and one for AC. Uh, the USB, uh, I don't have actually on right now, um, but as you can see, I have the four ports. I am charging my iPod as well with the included adapter, as you can see here. And up in the corner, if I turn the light off here, you can see we have the charging symbol up in the right corner, so it is working. 
So that is very cool that uh, it charges your iPod if needed. And also in the back, I have the adapter for my cell phone if needed, but I actually have my cell phone charger connected in the side here, which is still plugged into the phone I'm using right now to record this video. Also, I have a light switch plugged in as well, so we can test that out. There you go, Let's see it works. And while this is on, we also have my fan connected as well, as you can see to the best tech wall adapter. And now granted, I don't have every single port being used at the moment, sadly, because I didn't feel that it was really necessary. And I didn't have that many uh, things to plug in at this one moment. But for what it is, you can see that it does do all these things and all of them have the same power current going to them and you won't have an issue there. And the best part about it is it still is a surge protector. So if you have your computer plugged to it, a television plugged to it, anything electrical that will obviously get hurt from a power outage or a lightning strike of any sort uh, the this will actually save your devices um, as well as have the added feature of the USB ports also has the charging station for your phone uh, iPod or iPhone and as well as a nightlight built in uh, for added light I guess if you need it for at, at during the night and also has a screw hole right here which I didn't show but um have a screw hole here for added stability if you want to screw a hole in there for the end of the wall uh, so it's not going to go anywhere and in case you did have a computer plugged in here or something of that sort so very cool overall an amazing product i'm going to be using it for years to come uh, i will probably have an update video in the future of how it's still working and whatnot uh, for right now if you want to go check out a best tech wall adapter i'll have a link for it in the description below go check it out hope you purchase it and uh, let best tech know that i sent you and i hope you guys enjoyed this quick review and also my unboxing and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Peace.